Those Senate hearings on campaign fundraising focus today on former restaurant owner Charlie Tree, who raised more than $1 million for President Clinton and the Democrats. The money has since been returned. Investigators think that a lot of it came from one very elusive man in Asia. ABC's Linda Douglas reports. Meet one of the most mysterious suspects in the campaign finance investigation, Ng Lap Singh, also known as Mr. Wu, a multimillionaire from the Portuguese colony of Macau on the tip of mainland China. Mr. Wu evaded congressional investigators who went to Asia hoping to find him. But we caught up with him at one of his businesses in Macau. Wu says he made his fortune by being shrewd. My philosophy is that I should not break the law, but I wouldn't mind bending it. You saw him swear but today, an FBI agent working for the Senate committee testified <coughs> that Wu is not just a businessman, but an advisor to the Chinese government money to his to friend Charlie Tree. Tree, in turn, gave huge donations to the Democratic Party. Overall, it appears to me that Mr. Tree relied upon Mr. Wu's foreign, foreign wire transfers to make his contributions to the DNC. Senators were stunned to learn that beginning in 1994, Wu wired nearly one million dollars to Tree, the former Little Rock restaurant owner and friend of President Clinton's. A mind-numbing chart showed how Tree moved the money through various accounts. In your opinion, uh, did Mr. Tree launder money? Uh, yes, sir, in my opinion, he did. What did Mr. Wu want? Access to the president, in part. ABC News has learned Mr. Wu visited the White House at least six times. Wu won't talk about his transactions with Tree. Charlie's my friend, but I don't want to comment further. Today, ABC News talked with Tree in China, where he's monitoring the hearings. He says he is agonizing over whether to come home to the United States to defend himself. Linda Douglas, ABC News, Capitol Hill.